I've got some uh, little big little potatoes. All right. To get heated clear through. Yeah. And then uh, I just I got some room room for I got this. Oh yeah. Nice. Garlic, Parmesan, French bread. All right. A dollar sixty-eight at Walmart. <laughs> Looks good. Looks good. <laughs> and we'll heat that up in some aluminum foil and put it in the fire. All right. So we have our what are those Class B uh, golden potatoes, the small potatoes in that foil cooking there. And we have our French bread, a half a loaf of French bread cooking in there, and that has uh, already been seasoned. And we're going to put our ca cast iron kettle in there. And uh, what are we? What kind of fish are we cooking? Bass. White bass. We got some nice little uh, fillets or yeah, chunks I over there. Them. I chunked them out. Nice. I love eating bass. Catfish will work. My uh, my son uses this every once in a while with catfish or bass. River, River Rat Ron. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. River Rat Ron. He uses catfish in this recipe yeah. or bass. Either yeah. one, huh? Well, I suppose you could use any kind of fish, actually. Uh, Tell me what you got there. Uh, I got Mr. and Mrs. T's Bloody Mary mix, bold and spicy. Really? And what are you going to do with that? Well, we're going to basically uh, bake this bass in it in a cast iron kettle. So you've got the. So you're going to put you're going to pour that into the kettle right now, and Some then we're going to add. It. And we're going to add the bass. Some of it, and then put the bass right in there, and then pour some more over the bass. And, All right. And let her, let her cook while the potatoes and the bread are cooking. Or cooking. All right. Warm in there. Is that too hot, you think? Won't be now. Cool it down? Yep. And we'll cool it some more just as soon as we dump the rest of this on there. Well, you know it's cold when you're. <laughs> yeah, rinse off, off your, your fish, fish and, and they're freezing. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think the high was what, 19 today? Was it even, did it even well, get to I 19? I don't think it got that high. Uh, it's cold, I'll tell you that. Okay. Looks good. Well, that cast iron cooks so good. I mean, it's got to keep a good low heat on it now as low as we can that lid can. that lid shows uh, 163 degrees side of the pan shows 380 yeah uh, we wouldn't definitely wouldn't want it any hotter than that I wouldn't think okay. I'm gonna adjust the fire away from it a little bit so that it slows it down a little mr. and mrs. T bold and spicy Bloody Mary mix. A spicy blend with jalapeno, chipotle, and cayenne peppers. Made from scratch taste, it says. Alright, so at the top it's about 260 4 to 7, 267 right in there. And on the side, it's about 348. And in the oven, you would be about uh, 350, so. That's right where we want to be. Just sitting in there baking right now. Oh yeah, it's not sticking a bit. Yeah, they're starting to look. Oh yeah, starting to look flaky, aren't they? I'm gonna put this on a paper towel. There's a plate right there. It's uh, we're melting some butter in there in the GSI cup. We're going to drizzle over the top of our fish once it's uh, done. It's almost done now. Well, how long has it been? About an hour? About an hour on there? Yeah, about an hour. Uh, so we're getting close. 
check the potatoes, they're gone. Excellent. So we need to get this done so we can build that fire up. It's getting cold. I already carried some logs. Right <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're ready. What do you think? I think it's time to eat. Time to eat? Let's Butter's eat. Butter's melted, the bread's warm, the potatoes are cooked clear through. Excellent. And the uh, fish tastes great. Well, let's eat. They got the spoon. Dick Bartley just came on. Rock and Roll's Greatest Hits. One of my favorite radio shows. This on that stump. We'll just dip it up right out of there. Okay. Uh, oh yeah. That's good. Better get your plate. All right. Taters are nice and tender. Oh, yeah. They're done perfectly. 